Hi there. In this video, I will give you a general overview of our auto moderation feature. In short, auto moderation works like a smart social media assistant that can perform various tasks automatically. It works for Facebook, Messenger, Instagram, Facebook ads, and Instagram ads. Some of the main uses of auto moderation include automatically replying to comments and messages and other types of interactions, for example, profile mentions or reviews based on keywords or other triggers, protecting your brand image on social media by automatically deleting or hiding inappropriate comments and spam under your organic posts and ads. Moreover, this feature can automatically forward sensitive customer issues to dedicated support team members. And there's a whole lot more that auto moderation can do, and I'll show it in other videos, but for now, let's focus on a general rundown. First of all, auto moderation is now a fully fledged, separate feature that can be found in the main menu on the left. Here I can see the list of my already created social media automations, aka rules. I can easily navigate through my rules by social media profiles and platforms. If this box is yellow, it means that a rule is active, but I can deactivate it with just one click. By hovering over this question mark, I can see additional information about a given rule. And then with these three icons, I can also create a similar rule, edit the existing rule, or just permanently delete it. Alright, so let's create a new rule. I can use the three ready-to-go templates here, but I'll show them in another video. Right now, I'll create a rule from scratch by clicking on this yellow button. I'm going to create a rule that will answer repetitive questions on Facebook across multiple pages. The first thing is naming my rule, just for the better internal organization of the list of rules. I can also add some extra information about this rule. So I choose the social platform, which is Facebook, and then I choose my Facebook page or multiple pages. Remember that you first need to connect your social media profiles to Napoleon Cat. You should see the video tutorial in the top right corner now. Next, I choose the message type, private message. I can further specify it with a condition, for example, first message. But in this case, we'll leave it at all. I click on continue and move on to the trigger. User tags are optional and are most often used to automatically block spam and trolls. So let's move on to the keywords for now. Here I write the keywords that will trigger the automated reaction. Let me include keywords that pertain to pricing. And by the way, I can add an unlimited number of keywords and phrases. I can also add emojis as keywords, but I'll skip it in this case. Now what's really cool about auto moderation is that I can create up to six different triggers and then six different automated reactions, all inside one rule. I click on the plus here to automate different kinds of repetitive questions in one go. And I add different keywords for different triggers. As you can see, I put different keywords in these separate boxes. They refer to pricing, opening hours, and delivery times. Now it's time to define social media action. Of course, it's going to be an automated reply. Auto moderation will automatically address the user it will be replying to. Plus, I can create an unlimited number of replies. Once the rule is triggered, one of the replies will be randomly picked. This way, with my automated replies being different, it will all look a lot more human. So, I added my replies in each of the boxes. Always remember to click on continue throughout each step of the process. Next, I move on to the actions inside the Napoleon Cat tool. Here I can choose multiple actions at once. I click on Assign Moderator to assign my dedicated customer support team member so that he can monitor these repetitive questions and react manually if necessary. And I can also tag this message, let it be question. And I do the same thing for the remaining Napoleon Cat actions. Below I can include the emails that will receive a notification each time a rule is triggered. Next, I schedule this rule. I can make it active only during defined days or hours, but I'll just schedule it to start working right away, with no end date, 24-7. I click on Save and Run, and my rule is now active. I can see my newly created rule here. Of course, these are just some of the uses of our auto moderation feature. 
Stay tuned for more videos showing its various applications. If you want to automate your social media and save time for more strategic tasks, start our 14-day free trial. And if you have any questions, just contact us through our website and we'll be more than happy to help you guys. Until next time, bye-bye.